Hello, I'm Timothy Jordan, and you're watching The Developer Show. This is a very special episode because it's the 100th time we've brought you an update about the coolest developer news from Google. To celebrate, I've asked some of our friends to help out. The Accelerated Mobile Pages, or AMP, story format provides you with a mobile-focused format for delivering news and information as visually rich tap-through stories. To get started, head on over to the post for links to a tutorial and documentation. AMP for email is also now available for emails to be formatted and sent as AMP documents. As a part of this, we're kicking off the Gmail developer preview of AMP for email. So once you've built your emails, you'll be able to test them using Gmail. Take a look at the post for code and a link to the spec. Starting today, the API for purchases.products will return promo as a new value for the field purchase type when the user redeems a promo code. This improvement to the Google Play Developer API makes it easier to track your promotions from your own backend. For more details and links to the docs, check out the post. Go 1.10 is now available. It includes automatic caching of built-in test results as well as hundreds of other smaller changes. Links to the release notes and the download page are on the post. You can now integrate your server-side applications with the Firebase Cloud Messaging V1 API using the Firebase Admin SDKs, which allow you to send messages and manage topic subscriptions. Check out the post for some code and links to the docs. Compute Engine machine types with 96 vCPUs and up to 624 gigabytes of memory are now generally available. For applications that can scale vertically, you can leverage all 96 vCPUs to decrease the number of VMs needed to run your applications, while still reducing your total cost of ownership. Take a look at the post for more details. If you're wondering if you're prepared for your professional data engineer certification exam, well, Google Cloud Certified now offers an online practice exam. We designed it to help you familiarize yourself with the type of questions that will be asked and check your readiness. More details and a link are on the post. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share. I'm Timothy Jordan, and on behalf of all of us on the Developer Show team, thank you for watching. We'll see you next week. Not being able to see anything. <clears throat>